I spilt my whole cup of tea all over everything. <laughs> I'm really good at this. Really good at this. Anyway, oh, the RE stream's over. Hello. <laughs> my booby mouse pad is soaked. <laughs> Chiaki, no. So I put her in the bathtub. She needs to be cleaned. She needs to be cleansed. Happy Sunday! How do I stream? How are you all doing? Obviously, I'm not very good at it. <laughs> Thankfully, it went on the floor mostly, so now my room smells like green tea. Uh, I cleaned the floor. The floor is very shiny now. Uh, yeah. Jackie got some tea, tea, tea boobies. Tea booba. Did I make more tea? Indeed. No, it didn't follow me. I'm just small brain. <laughs> How's everybody doing? Happy Sunday. I didn't stream last week because last week was Mother's Day and, um, you know, my mom on Thursday, we took her out for dinner, but then on Sunday, she's like, so what are we doing? And I'm like, mom. So I took her to get donuts and then we ended up going for a walk and doing Mother's Day stuff. So that was fine. And now we are here. I know it didn't follow me. You were look for spoilers. Your mom did that too. Wait, actually? Because I was like, Mom, we'll go out during the week because, like, Sunday restaurants, don't do it. Don't do Mother's Day restaurants. It's crazy. And she's like, okay, so now what's happening on Mother's Day? Because she was off. <laughs> uh, oh, my goodness, Mom. Mom, please. What happened since, um, since last stream? Um, I've been working a lot on our emotes. I don't know if I have any previews to show you all. Did I take any recent screenshots? Do I show spoilers? Do you want to see emote spoilers? God, using a mouse without a mouse pad, this feels so like 2000s. Which one do I got? What do I got? Um, I've got these three. Let's do these three. Actually 12, okay. Thank you for the 35 months. Which time thank you for the 54 months? Yes. These are, oh, they're so small. <laughs> Thank you, damn. These are the new ones. I changed our lull. So the first ones are a new lull. Second one's a new derp. And then obviously the gasm's like exactly the same as the current gasm. So it's not much of a spoiler. It's just new. New girl who dis. Yeah. <laughs> I made the derp more like head empty, pretty much. Let's see. And then I also have the lurk. The lurk hasn't changed that much. I. Actually, it's the new girl, but, you know, pretty much the same. Uh, <laughs> the chibified horns. I know, I was like, how chubby can I make them? Are we getting a new stabby? Yeah, and a new, like... I'm trying to remake all the favorite ones. I realized I have five emotes missing. I have 22 emote slots, and I don't think I have 22 regular emotes uploaded. So, you know, surprise emotes. I was like, okay, I need to make more. So I think Twitch gave partners five more or something. I don't remember what happened, but they're there. Crumbs posh. Have you not seen the posh? Okay, I have to show the posh. Do I have the posh somewhere? Uh, I thought I did. I know I have it somewhere. Hold up. Here somewhere, maybe. Where? Where? I thought I put it in uh, Discord, maybe. I don't know. Did I? Where I did. Lost. <laughs> Looking through my sketches is so cursed. <laughs> Why am I like this? Yeah, I can't find it on here, but I think I posted in Discord. I was posting the updates in the suggestions channel. It isn't there, but I'll post it again. Animated time? I know I'm going to try to animate some to you. Be a good time. I want to make an animated, um, like, pop cat emote, like the... That one is great. Okay, what am I doing? I think ooh, we got to Millennia. She is down here. Down, down here. Down, down here. And I think we pretty much cleared the Halic tree. Uh, we beat Mog last stream. We beat a lot of bosses last stream, actually. 
I think I have to go back to the snow area and explore a little bit because I think this is a mine, right? That's what those mean. Maybe I'll go there first as a warm up. I haven't played in a week. Well, two weeks. Technically, so. Chroma boof. Okay, no, I need a stabby one. And um, I have a note taking emote as well, I posted. Because I really like them. They're so cute. So I'm going to try to animate that one. That one's going to be the hardest. I've never done emote animation. I've never done animation before. Other than like 2010 uh, pixel animation. And literally, it's just like a slideshow pixel thing. Eats Chomsky. You're going to eat me? Although I stream if you eat me. Grim Dagger bought 35 months. Yeah, I like that one. So cute. I have a feeling something's just gonna absolutely destroy me here. It's telling me to go there, but this doesn't look safe. Can I make it? Can I make it? Just nothing, but. Ah! <laughs> I'm here to watch gamers and chew bubblegum and I'll look. Here's something. I'm all out of gum! Spark of the boy. Hello, Revy. How are you? Why is. What's shaking? What's shaking? Hello? Who are you? Can't see shit. Get to the safety light, get to the safety light, get to the- Dear god. Can we turn the lights on, please? Stop. Stop. I just wanted a nice little warm- What? Where'd the lightning come from? Where- Where am I? <laughs> um... No, oh, no, not the singing ladies. Craving tacos, ooh. Um, it's doing the drive-by, don't mind me. Beep beep. Oh, I've been here. Uh oh, yeah, I have. Taco, get tacos. I think I did go down here, actually. I thought I did. This is definitely a joke. Wait. No, I haven't. Maybe? Oh god, I don't know. Finally finished Elden Ring. Now you can watch stream? Hello, Gaunt. I know. That's the beauty of... Wait, have I been here? No. Okay. I don't think so. I don't... I'm going crazy. Uh, the beauty of being very slow at beating games is everybody will beat it before me, and nobody has to worry about spoilers. <laughs> I have not been here. Okay. First enemies is so random in this place. Oh god. I'll be afraid. Also, my health bar is massive. Will this be a good warm up? I'll find out. You're even slower and <laughs> you haven't beat it yet, oh my god. That's okay. It's definitely the beauty of taking your time in a game. You get to enjoy it. Is this the f like one of the first Miyazaki doors in this game? In a Miyazaki game? Nani. Um, there's a guy behind me. Yeah, there is. I'm gonna head out. Um, you guys just want to vibe here? That's cool, too. Wee! Deep fried Oreos, they're so good. Very deadly. I could definitely only eat one, <laughs> but it's a good treat. I never realized, I was like, what do they deep fry Oreos in? But it's pancake batter. You just make pancake batter 
and you put Oreos in it and then you deep fry it. And you can do that for any sweet. You literally just take the thing, chocolate bar, cookie of your choice, dunk it in pancake batter and then deep fry it. Because pancake batter, when it's fried, gets really fluffy. Deep fried Oreos? Yeah, it's so good. <laughs> Noxella dragons, druids, bears, and everything else. Wait, really? <laughs> God. Hi, who are you? Oh, you don't want to talk. Okay, cool. That's fine. You deep fry a pancake? I mean, you can deep fry anything if you try hard enough. Actually, yeah, deep fried pancakes are a thing. They're called pancake puppies. It's literally a ball of pancake dough and they deep fry it, and then they put icing sugar and like chocolate on them. Pancake puppy! The fact that I know all this makes me sound like I just eat everything, <laughs> which is not wrong. That's a suspicious looking- wait, what? Weren't you a boss, sir? Aren't you the guy who- Bro, bro! What? How is he so fast? He's not prepared for this. Why is he so skinny? Are you- I thought he was naked for a second. Where are your clothes at? My reaction time is not on par. I did not have my tea. I spilled my tea. Where are your clothes? I like a centipede. Oh, don't move like that. Don't, don't stop. Don't. Ding, ding. I got like a centipede looking. Market. God. Japanese. Monka. How do you know this is a Canadian? Because that sounds American. <laughs> I eat everything. I'm Kirby human form. Well, that's not wrong. Yeah. Hey, Roxo. I know I spilled my tea all over my desk and my booby mouse pad, so now I have no mouse pad. Bad. Is this the door? This is the door? This is the door? Like, uh, dry elves? No more booby. Booby is gone. Wait, is this the boss? Is that it? This is a small cave. I'm sorry, what? Again? With the nerd's rope, man? Oh, dear God. <laughs> oh, not again! No! Why? Um, I was not... Oh my God, you're so fast. I don't think my brain can keep up with you right now. I guess I'll just die. I can't use my horse either. Like, how am I supposed to get close to you, man? I'll get there eventually. I can't hit him! Uh oh. I need my archer, man. Please don't eat me. Please don't eat me. What are you doing? This thing is so awkward to fight without a horse. Can I hit the rope? Ah! I know you're supposed to hit his face, but... Yeah, these things are so weird. Oh god, this is when Immortal Kombat's you, right? I know this boss, the first time I saw it, I was like, wait, what? What game am I playing? Is this Bloodborne? But I guess there are a lot of, like, astral um, imagery in this game, too. Not so much Eldritch Horror, but... 
I'm surprised you fight it twice, though. Because I thought he would be, like, a unique boss. He's, uh, he's very different. Hit him in the eye! Hit him in the eye! Get him! Get him! He's gonna blow up! I don't care! Where'd he go? Where'd he go? Where'd he go? Oh my god! I think I'm dead. <laughs> there are worse offenders of the reuse? What, you mean like our favorite? The Lord and Savior? Godskin Nobles? And Godskin Noble Large? Whee! The name of the monster is the same, but the title's different? Yeah, what was the first one? Maybe there's like... A few of them? Because it could mean that there's like hundreds of them in space and you're like, oh shit, that's uh, probably not good. Or there's only like a few. You're born of a void. That is so delayed. Oh. Ready? Four. Skeletons! Good luck, skeletons. I only noticed because I have a clip open. Oh. I'm gonna... I think my skeletons are dead already. I forgot he came down again. I think my skellies are dead. Just gonna smack him. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. How are you supposed to- He like zip- He like- What? He dipsy doodled. I thought he was gonna be directly behind me. He was not. He like snaked around. Okay. Skeletons are not the way to go for once. Natural born of the void and stars of darkness. Huh. I feel like it's pulling a... Well, you know how there's all this tree conflict going on? Well, you know, eldritch horror things. You think your problems are so significant in the world, but then the eldritch horrors from space come and they're like, you really think your problems have you even started? Hello, Elder Tours here. Hello. Ow. This thing is so tanky, though. Where are you gonna go? Where's it gonna go? I don't know. I'm just gonna keep rolling. <laughs> it's so scary. It just insta kills me. Um. Okay. I'm oh, sorry. I just remembered I was gonna turn off my death kind timer because or death counter because I totally lost count. I'm surprised they haven't announced a DLC yet, but I mean, they could announce it any time people would play it, so. I find these things very hard to fight. These things and the gravity bull. Dude, mans. Yippee! It's only been three months. True. It feels like it's been a lot longer, actually. Oh. Eh. Eh. Can I cut your neck? It looks very unstable. Okay, where are you? Maybe if I don't get up. 
Oh, I went under him. I think. Where'd he go? <gasps> Where'd he go? Where'd he go? Where'd he go? I want the shiny orange crystal in its belly. If I hit that, does that do my damage? I don't like special. Actually, he's got a few. I forgot about that. How am I supposed to hit you? Oh. At least he's going over there. You can stay over there, that's fine. Oh god. Oh god. <laughs> I forgot about that. He's got like the shiny one on his tail. That looks important. Is that on your tail? Whoa. I think he's too long for the arena. Seems he only does the like the gank once. That hurt. You did it. Okay. God. I feel like that would be so much easier to kill with uh with a horse. I imagine magic trivializes a little bit. Yeah, there are quite a few bosses. I think if you're magic only would be hard because they're so aggressive, but there are a lot of bosses that really stay back, especially if you have a summon. Magic helps a lot. Wait, can I not? Is there a teleport here? Can I teleport here? Bandai announced Dark Souls 3 DLC before the game even came out. Oh yeah, they did. <laughs> Uh, might be due to how gigantic. Yeah. Like, don't rush people. Even if they announce it, it would probably be like, oh yeah, it'll come out in a few years. Spot switch. Is there no... Teleport out? In here? What? Weird. Oh, it's over here. I feel like I missed a lot in this cave. Oh. Monster Hunter, there's a size chart that shows all the monsters. Yeah, Elden Ring would be like, <laughs> it would be massive. There are so many massive bosses. Like the giant. He's huge. He's what you could call giant, I would think. I don't even think I went. Oh, oh no, I did. Hi. I've been here. Knife throw. Executed. They're still finishing content for the base game, like NPC quests. That's true. And then making it a little easier to do NPC quests. Gonna do a quick run through to make sure I got all the stones. Hey, an item. Whee. Someone did do a size comparison? Ooh. I'd like to go this way. This way looks cool. Bye. Uh oh. I've changed my- wait, they're fighting. You guys fight. I'm gonna leave. Uh -huh. I'm leaving! I'm leaving! Ah! Oh no. I gotta find my way out. Hey, gasket! I drink my tea. Let's not spill my tea everywhere. Hey, some souls. Thank you. Yeah, I love seeing the close ups, especially of NPCs. The NPC. Did I go the wrong way? Where am I? Where did you come from? Where did you go? I 
Um, okay, bye. Thought I came from down, but I could be wrong. I've been wrong before. I guess I could just find the end again and teleport out. This cave was kind of random. There's gotta be lore behind these, like, rock people, right? <laughs> rock people lore. Oh. I haven't seen much about them, but I could have missed some stuff. Once I go to Millennia, I'm probably going to be fighting her all stream. So I want to do some uh, like side content first. Just kind of as a warm up because I guess the first thing I will ask about her boss fight that I was curious. I know she's hard. Is she hard because she has a gimmick or is she hard because she's hard? Like an actual difficulty. I'm really hoping there's not a gimmick. And by gimmick, I mean like, oh, you have to use a certain item and it makes the fight 10 times easier. I'm kind of hoping, kind of both. Fuck. I was like, can't she just actually be difficult? Why do all these fights have to have gimmicks? I'll find out soon enough. I'm gone. Like, I just want it to be a good old f difficult fight, not like a. Me dumb. Me didn't know I had item, so, uh, people laugh at me. Oh, no, 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 I'm stuck! <laughs> Two very specific things. Well, I know she heals when she hits me. So I fought her for about 12 seconds, and, uh, she showed me that. Like, uh, Mog, I guess Mog, for an example, technically had, like, a gimmick item. I don't know what it was, but somebody said it was something you could craft to get rid of his... Neil! It was a Physic Flask for Mog? Okay. So it's definitely, like, possible to beat him without it. Obviously, you can chug Sunny D like I did. Like, there's no tomorrow and you're a bottomless pit. Or you could use that item. Hey, it's a turtle! Is he shooting lasers? Hello. Um... Um... What? Why? Why? What? <laughs> Who are these lads? And why are they fine? What? Oh my god, get me down here. This is fine. Just gonna vibe down here. Why? Why does it not hit them? Are you done? That seems rigged. I was thinking there's a safe path, but uh, it doesn't look like it. Maybe against the wall is my best bet. Uh... 
<laughs> it's fine. It's fine. Um, ow. Rest! <laughs> okay. I made it. Good job. Yeah, I'm a little 120. Could get one more endurance. Carson? Are you alive? Hello? He's breathing. Hello? Feed! Where's my... Toes. Toes. He's alive? Why don't you talk to me? Enhance. What did you give? What, what did I take? Was that a talisman? It looks like a talisman. Mirrors? Maybe not. Oh, it's probably a weapon, isn't it? What is this one? Maybe a shield? Oops. Nope. Key. How come this one goes in a weird order? Oh, I guess I did just get that back. That is probably why. Um. That was a shield. Why? Shield of a radiant of radiant silver, festened with amber and carried by Loretic Knight of the Hallig Tree. Sheep is said to imitate that as sacred drop of dew, which inspired the absurd rumor that Loretta herself was an Alpenrack. Then who are you? Summon wait. Sister of ours, let the birthing droplet in and create life for us, for all the Albanorix. Um, thank you. I finally fulfilled my purpose. Our young yet towering sister will give us hope. Now that nothing is left unfinished, I will join you in battle to the bitter end. And when the fighting is done, then you may lay me to rest. Beside Lobo, my dear wolf. Aww. Interesting that the summons have, like, quest lines, too. What did you do to her? Now I'm kind of worried. Gonna wake up when I rest? Oh, she's Libby. She was a sleepy lass. Interesting. Oh, the jellyfish! Aww. This place seems very peaceful, but sad at the same time. I think I'm gonna knock the turtle down so he doesn't try to... How is he shooting? Are there mages on his back or what? Is it just a certain amount of these, like, 
barnacle things you need to break, or is there actually, like, set damage that you have to do to these things? Oh my god. The other ones usually fall down right away. Than barnacles, but I don't know if there's a set amount you need to destroy. Yeah, I just kind of wonder, like, why? Why is that a knock it down? I guess it's painful to cut them off? I don't know. Are they what's holding them up? <laughs> um, so these are obviously the ones that I used. I don't want to do this one. Turtle has barnacles. Need to destroy them. That's all we got. This forest is interesting. There might be something like around here? Wish the bell went up into this room. Because where does it go? <laughs> That's true. Where does it go? Um, um, mm. Mm. Hello. Does he have no head? You have no head. Where'd your head go? Barnacles are painful and they can't rest till they fall off. That would make sense. You can't, like, sit down. Aw, then it makes you feel bad for him. So we're doing a good deed. Makes me feel better. Bismarck. I don't like these little buggers. Quiet. Too quiet. I've been up there. Is there anything else that anybody can think of in this snow area? Or this snow area that I missed? Who's this? I'm interested to learn more about this area as a whole. That spot seems way too open not to have a boss. New death burb? I fought death burb. Sanguine noble. I think so. That doesn't ring a bell. Who's this guy? He seems like a regular enemy. Giga Chad regular enemy. The death bird was interesting. Obviously I've been here. I came here first. I actually found this place right away. I think past it. Like the minor earth tree. Maybe there's something here. The southeast over oh god like this part or like over here well that's just the giant area I don't know if there's anything else here
That's where the dragon was. Invader. I need to check this little nook up here. And then northwest of the ruins. The ruins I'm at right now. Is that the river following me? This is just the tree. Yeah. We'll do a little loop de loop. Go this way. I already did. There's a little dude up here. Is this a health? Are you a health one? No, you're not. I don't think. What are you doing? Hey! No! He's stuck. I remember going along here. Mm. That looks boss like down there, but is that where I fought that lizard thing? I think it is. Yeah. Yeah, Mog's dead. I've been to Millennia. Oh. I've seen the last. Well, uh, I've seen Godric. I was going to say the last boss. I don't know if he's the last boss, but I don't really want to fight him until I do a lot of other content first. I want to stay up here. Um, is there really nothing in this area? Rising. I forgot to tweet that I was streaming. <laughs> um, this is just like that area kind of near the beginning. Yeah, they're all the ladies with the wolves. Just a few hidden things left. Oh yeah, this is where the map is. Yeah. Did you do the Latena quest? Uh, the thing I just did right now? Yeah, I don't think because there's really nothing unless there's something here, but I think that's just the tree. I think that's it there. It's the hidden things. And this is all just like nothing. Here. Okay. I never knew what the cave indication was, so maybe I missed some caves. Really. There's gotta be at least like a cave in each area. Like I haven't been here. So I should probably go there. Let's see. And then is that the cave that Patches is in? How come it's not flagged as something? I thought it was. No, he was a was he up here? I think he was there. That's another one. Another point of interest close to you now, to the east. Like down this way? Or like up here maybe? Or like way, way east? Yeah, I don't want to just start the stream fighting a boss. I want to do some side content first because I haven't played in two weeks. A circle. It's very hard to 
<laughs> play this game once every two weeks and then like fight bosses. People be like, oh, this game's easy. I beat it just sitting here for 25 hours. Yeah, you become a god after 25 hours. Try playing every 25 weeks. It's hard. You have to relearn. Oh god. Okay. I'm just gonna... Yeah, circle. Um, I don't like these things. Um... Oh boy. Is that what the circles are? These stupid runes. The towers. And then, oh great, so I have to do something in the fog. Skeleton scouted out. So creepy. They remind me of Pinwheel. I hate it. Get him, Scally. <laughs> I just want the item. Okay. We took pauses for a couple of days in between sessions. Wasn't looking forward to returning to some encounter. Yeah, it's hard. I think last stream I fought a lot of big bosses too, so I was like, oh god. Say, must solve the puzzle. Mm, boy. How am I supposed to solve the puzzle if I can't see anything? Don't kill him. No. Bad. Well. I'm gonna try to kill the meatballs first. Demon Souls meatballs. They're very creepy. I assume the lore behind them and how they're made is uh, very wholesome. No meatball reward? Well, usually there's a little book telling me what the puzzle is. There's no book. Hello. Um. Oh, hey. Okay. Uh, I didn't want to be friends anyway. It's cool. Jesse, thank you for the 43 months. Oh, hi. Thing saw me and it's like, nope. Yeah, let's kill all you. Might already have some lore. Oh boy. Meatball lore. Oh, oh my god. It's lock on. Hey, Christian. Millennia today? I think so. I think after I do a little bit of side content and kind of get used to the game again, <laughs> I'll attempt. Come here! I'm just gonna keep swinging while I'm not looking. I had to kill all of them? Is that what this is? Find out. Whee! I have to defrost that statue.
Or does it, do I have to climb up there? Please, no. Okay, follow the light. Where am I going? Follow you first. That tower doesn't have a book, though. Unless it's not in front of the tower. Where are you taking me? I can't remember if they actually take you to places you've been before. It might. to follow him. He's going. Look at him go. He's trying so hard. Where'd he go? things like on the turtle is that why I'm just gonna leave oh god where are you going where'd he go you went down where are you taking me Is this the same one? I can make the jump, right? Oh, no. But this was an open window. It was not. This is gonna go very well. It's still gonna be locked, though. <laughs> Can't tell if this is actual ground or not. Okay. Cool. I just went all the way around with that guy? And he just took me here? Really? I just need to make them hit each other? Is that what this is? There's another one, because they keep respawning, so. Come here. Oh, this one, smiley face. Back each other. Do you, you have to hit each other? Is that what it is? No, you can't hit each other. Okay, good. I'm hit the statue then. Do something. No? Do 
do I need to kill you both here? Come here. I'm trying to like half get them to hit the statues, but I don't think that's it. That's it either. Damn these mages and their puzzles. Okay, let's try setting it on fire. And stand back a little bit. Really? Want the defrost the statue? Okay. What the fuck? <laughs> you guys can give me a hint. These these freaking towers, man, mages, mages. Got the three things uh, I've wanted to try brain empty now. We're friends now. Oh, they're holding hands. Reflection. That makes me think that I have to make them hit each other again, but be on the other side? Because there's two of them. I'm climbing the mountain. Where'd the other one go? There was two. One. They hurt. You guys gonna smack each other across from it? Over here? Where'd your other guy go? Come here. Is it far away from the thing? Goddamn mages, man. Yeah, they followed me forever. Do I have to refreeze them in the same position? Do I have to make them jump off this to their death? Goodbye. Where'd you get the fire? I don't know what consumables I have. Well, it's definitely not them hitting each other, because I think they've hit each other quite a few times. <laughs> gonna die trying to figure this puzzle out. <laughs> Remember the first time you fight these enemies in that like little catacombs? Oh. Oh yeah, I guess that's a thing. I'm like, does that have to be a cross? This is the conundrum from the day. Millennia will have to wait till next week. Okay, you guys can just tell me because <laughs> I know I'm just gonna get a memory stone and uh very useful item for me. Very useful. Take a sippy. And B, thank you for the raid. How are you? 
I do the jellyfish? Did I do the jellyfish? Oh, like the cute one? Like the ones who are sisters? Yeah. Hey, B, how are you? And welcome. How was your stream? Oh, do I go back to this cursed place? Let's go. The crystal darts? Similar? I thought you would be cheating. Mages always cheat. Welcome to the stream. Get some Genshin, had a very cozy morning. Ooh, that sounds good. I haven't played Genshin in so long. I feel like I'm too far behind. That playing catch up would take me forever. I played a lot when Ido came out again. Got him max and then didn't play. <laughs> Who's your favorite character? Oh, so is it a summon? Or is it a... Wait, what's this? Where are you taking me? That way. Okay, we will do this quickly. It will happen. Just start playing with a couple weeks ago. Oh wow, you love Sayu. Sayu is so cute. I really love the character designs. It's a very cozy game. Pretty much has unlimited gameplay too, which can be a blessing or a curse. <laughs> First, actually, I think I do have a. Oh, I think I get it. Let's see. Do I have a little summon of them? I think I do. Somewhere, maybe. Is that it? No, no. Little gremlin guys? I don't actually see one. I was thinking I'm just gonna get them to fight each other, but I don't think I have one. I didn't realize that she became a spirit, like, voluntarily. She's renowned as a deft ma magic archer, but having lost her beloved wolf, she cannot move from the place where she was summoned. Interesting. I don't think I have their spirit. I miss it. Are those baby skeletons? They look like baby skeletons. I still haven't tweeted I'm streaming. One second. I'll do that. There you go. Nailed it. I'm glad your stream went well. And I'm glad you're liking Genshin. Genshin's very fun. Very well made game. I do enjoy gachas where you don't have to spend money and you can actually play to keep up with it. Turn brain rot. I don't know how many new characters they've released. I haven't played since uh, Ayato came out. I think he came out. They got good character design. And then the new girl that's with Ido, the ninja girl, she's really cute too. Crystal darts. Let's try just throwing it. Nope, I got nothing. <laughs> what do I have to do? 
You're going to go lurk and relax. Have a good Sunday. And thank you for stopping by. And thank you for the raid. Much appreciated. Endless Zone Zero? No. What is that? Okay, I'm going to Google this one, maybe. I don't know what I'm supposed to do here. Albernic Rise. Are they all called that? I think they are. Albernic Rise Puzzle. Apparently it's a common Google. You can buy the summon at one of the merchants. Wait, is that actually it? You just have to do the summon? That's the thing I hate about these puzzles. It's like, it could be as easy as me just doing it wrong or just having no item to do it. Let's see what it says. Oh, you can use the bewitching branch or a few crystal darts on one of the two imps patrolling the tower to make them kill each other instead. Okay, so my idea was right. But why? Okay, sure. I was gonna say, can you not just make them hit each other then? Like I was trying to make them just smack each other, which they definitely were. It says throw the darts at it and it'll make it go a little crazy, I think. Gotta get them pretty close. Can you please hit him? How many? I don't even know if I have a bewitching branch. Gotta check. Stop chasing me for a second. New game from Mihoyo they're gonna be working on. It'll be the new Genshin? Oh my god. They're making another one already? Genshin's massive. Nice thing about having horizontal progression. You never feel left behind on content. Yeah. So it's like I can go back. Okay, they're gonna follow me. And eventually I want to. I don't think I have a bewitching branch. Maybe I'll just go buy it. Academy gate. The Urania, the Academy gate? Wait, not oh, in down here. Where is the merchant here? Maybe I never found him. Isolated merchant. Is that him? No. I don't think I found her grapes yet. This one. Nomadic merchant. when you enter the academy. So he's like somewhere in here? I'm gonna go from this one maybe? Or like go inside? Upgrade? This one. Yeah, I'll check if I have a branch recipe. I haven't been back here in, uh, since I actually did it. So, does it look like a branch? I think I checked before if I had the bewitching branch recipe and I don't think I actually had it. Doesn't look like it. Maybe he has it. <laughs>
So is he inside from here? Walk through that. This. Yeah, I don't think I ever went down here. That goes. He is called the Isolated Merchant, so, uh... Hey, Max, how are you? Happy Sunday. Yeah, what are you doing down here? Why? I want the wolves to attack us. Been ages since I found a customer. Have a safe journey. Make sure the wolves aren't coming. Oh, they are. Have a safe journey. Oh. Is he one of the only ones that actually sells ashes? I haven't seen another one. Right, let's buy everything. And he has three of these? Damn. Okay. Available as a keepsake at the start of the game. Oh my gosh. Hmm. The more you know. I'm just gonna spend all my money. These are very cheap. There, now you're rich. All you have to say? You're rich? I don't think I ever went through this gate. I guess that makes sense. Oh, well, that's why you can't go. Hello? Got the same sword, we're matching. Oh. It did, it just ports you to the... Oh. I don't know if I went down the other way then. I wish these merchants function like Resident Evil 4. I feel like it would have been both funny and memorable to have one guy just magically appear in places. <laughs> he just shows up like, hello. I just love how they all comment on how they haven't had a customer in ages and you're like, no shit. And thank you for the help. You know, the bridge is so pretty. What's this way? I must have gone this way, right? Right? Oh yeah, this is to the... Maybe there's something on the bridge? Hides in a volcano. <laughs> Wait, I haven't gone on here. Like, what? I think because it teleports you into the middle, it doesn't really... You don't really think to look again? I don't know. I make this fall. I don't know. Try? Uh oh. Nope. <laughs> Cannot. Confirmed. Good thing I spent all my money on that isolated merchant. That was just like a, a scripted death. Debated. Well, I got one of those seeds. I wonder if I can upgrade it. Is that the this? No, this is. Wait. Do you get more golden seeds than you need? And what's over there? Yes. Oh. Interesting. 
What is this? And why does it look important? And why does it look like I haven't been there? What's up there? This area was massive. I found it very hard to actually find things. Especially in the lake. Oh god. Lord Lobsters. Let's see. I know I went straight, but did I go up? Jellyfish. Yeah, maybe I haven't gone up here yet. It looks important. Looks like something's here. Um... Giant man. I guess this is a good reason why you always check the starting areas again. It's like the horse, uh, the centennial at the beginning. Or sentinel. Uh-oh. Okay. The thing? Um. I'm gonna s wait. What? This is my explorer, give me a second! No! There's a bunch of them. This is what I wanted. The four bell fries. Well, they give you one. Boy. I guess I'll go in this one first. Where are you gonna take me? Watch as it takes me places I've already been in. It's like, look at this secret place! And you're like, ah. Wait, you can get here super early? Oh wow, this is uh, really disorientating. Very sideways. Ooh, you can see it from another angle. Huh! It gives you sneak peeks of areas. Oh, kind of like that one with the giant on the bridge that brings you to the castle. Right away. And you're like, oh, I'm at the endgame castle. And I assume these things just absolutely destroy you if you're not leveled. Yep, he's still pretty tanky. Come here! Stop jumping! Yeah, you could run into this guy super early and be like, um, I need to leave. Huh. Just on a rock. <laughs> okay. Can't get back up now, so let's, uh, go back here. So is this like four sneak peeks or I guess three? I think there's only three. Three sneaky peekies into the future. This is one like at the back of this. <laughs> well, I guess in a way it's good I found this later because no spoilers. No sneaky peekies.
had to find out on my own with my own leggies. Actually, that reminds me. I think there's another boss. Where am I? Okay, wait, what? This is a new place. Wait, what? Where am I? What? Oh, this is the place I saw a boss. The Chapel of Anticipation? Wait, this is back at the beginning of the game. Wait, is it? Oh my god, we get to kill this boss? My goodness. I did not know this was a thing. I guess, yeah. Okay. Um. Prevent. I still don't like fighting these things. I will say. <laughs> Revenge. I did not expect to do that much damage here, but it's kind of funny. Gotta like drag the battle out a little bit, you know? Oh, I missed. Oh no. This is new game plus. Yeah, take that. Ornamental straight sword. So you can actually go back into like the starting area. That's kind of cool. A sword. Okay. Slender straight sword pattern after a unique antique arm ornament. I can't read. Superior swordsmanship preferred to be able to blah blah blah. After fa falling from grace, the dregs of the golden lineage sought power and purpose. That is a tongue twister. Dark Souls 1 style. That's true. Never too late to do the tutorial. Like if I go back, will there be anything new? Kinda cool to come back here and look to see. Like what is this looking at? This is looking at oh, this is looking at the castle, like Stormvale right away. And right away you get the big image of the tree that was not on fire before, but uh maybe, maybe there's something new. Maybe I missed something. God, those blue pillars are very obnoxious. <laughs> They're like, can you see me? Man, I don't remember much of this. Mm. Hey. Hey, this way. Wait, how did I... Did you jump down? For a door? Am I blind? Or is this just where I spawn? Hey, Epic, how are you? Change hair. God, I do not remember the beginning of the game at all, apparently. It is a maiden. Dead maiden. Maidenless. This is a church. Oh, well, it did say the chapel of what? What is it called? The chapel of what was known. There's nothing. Need a sippy? Drink too much tea, I'm gonna pin the pants. Mm. Oh, yes. Maybe she was our maiden and we weren't supposed to be maidenless? Oh. What? Did I not get up before? Now I need to see again. Like, did it break? Is this place more dilapidated than it was? It was closed before. Who opened it? 
Where the heck did it go? Was it not a ash? Oh, is that it? The storm? No, where? It was an ash, right? It's, wait, what? It's a key item? It literally looked like an ash summon. Wee. Ashes of a hawk, which heeds no sum. Ashes of a hawk revered by all others as sovereign back in the days when Stormville's winds still raged like no other. This ancient monarch is proud, however, refusing to answer anyone's summons. <laughs> what? It is a summon, but you can't summon it. Now I'm like, who, who opened that door? Done it. That's for me. I get the hawk. It's not for me. I don't get it. Not me. This one me. Den, den, den. Spirit of a fierce hawk that faithfully rendered lifelong service to the old king. The old king of Stormvale. When the true storm raged, its cries emboldened embo its fellows in battle. And blah, 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 blah. Interesting. I want to know who opened the door. I'm trying to remember where we came from. Did we just spawn in the church? No. Yes. No. No, we did not. Yes. Oh, yeah, we did just spawn in the church. And then you fight the thing, and then you get sent to the other area. Toriel is after this part. We just plopped into existence. Okay, I'm assuming there's nothing else here, because that's pretty big. The so key item means I have to give it to somebody. The area seems very important. Like, the statue seems very important. Like, but I read at the beginning of the game. Read the summon? I see. The bird seems kind of cool. Does it have knives attached to its feet? I hope so. Mm, switch. Burp. I don't think I can summon here. Find somewhere. And then what? If you beat the boss, you actually just like walk out here instead? And then what? Yeah, what happens if you kill the boss? Oh. Um, that, <laughs> and then you get teleported. Oh, what the fuck? <laughs> oh my god. Okay. I just want to take a peek. <laughs> I did not expect that. That actually startled me a little bit. That was good. That was good. Yeah, I, yeah. This is why I don't ask questions. I get my own answers. Even if you win, you lose. These are fun. It's like a, it's like a little gift box. What's gonna be behind door number three? Place your bet. Where, where am I? Oh, this is your, uh, oh, there's a castle up there. Where? They're like, no big deal. You're in space on a big rock. Space rock. Ooh. And it's like, look, look at all this place you can go to. And then you can go up there. That place looks fun, too. Yeah. Lots of fun. On a big old rock. What are you doing there? Oh, God, is that a crucible night? 
There's no way. Wait, can I actually not go anywhere on here? Is there nothing on this rock? Rock of nothingness? Okay, we can go down. Okay. Oh god. Is that a crucible night? I hope not. That'd be mean at this point in the game. If you found this right at the beginning, they make you fight one of these guys. And then you'd be terrified to come here and you'd be like, I never want to find this place. Bullying, honestly. Hello. Oops, oh god. I still don't like these guys. Never mind, he turned around to kick. Amy's- oh, too quick. Can you imagine you go to Sparta kick him and he just like grabs you, sumo tosses you off the edge. Is this gonna break too? Okay. Neat. I would like to make a house on this rock. I like this place, it was fun. Mog's place was a good time. Enjoying the creepy aspects of it. I feel like I definitely missed something down here. I don't know though. Like what's over here? Is there anything over here? Can I even get over there? Like that looks like a little bridge. I did miss or I did find everything. How do you unlock secret ending where the lobster uprising dooms everyone? Oh my god. Lobsters are terrifying. They're the scariest enemy in this game. Oh god, I drank too much tea. I have to pee. Nope. The mimic tier? I don't think I ever got the mimic summon. Chroma inhales Pryacy. Pryacy. <laughs> I was like, what is it trying to say? Zammy, thank you for the 51 months. If Gobert grafted lobsters and said he may have had a funny chance, true. Very true. Like, this looks like I'm missing something, and that looks like I'm missing something. Maybe I'll go. Maybe we can fight. Millennia a little bit first. Do a few attempts. I think she was from here? I'm gonna go pee quickly. As long as I'm not dying. When I summon. I dead? Oh, she's at the roots. She's not here. The roots. Can only go well. If you didn't get the Mimic Ash, that means there's another area out there to explore. Oh god. Down where I just was? Okay, I'll do a little city. Am I broken? There we go. We good. Oh. <laughs> Jumps backwards right into the boss fight before I even am ready. It's fine. It's fine. Okay. Um. Well, I guess I'll just go for it, right? Why not? Um... I've seen her once, and I was like, nope. She's very slow. But somebody said if you throw stuff at her, she just jumps. Yeah. Oh, I did hit her. <laughs> I didn't think I would actually hit her. At least she has a chair down here, right? I don't think she staggers either. I think I tried. Oh, yeah she does. The jumping attack. Oh 
Oh, she does. But I guess technically she could just out duel you because every time you you have to hit her more than she hits you. You can't just like out Sunny D her. Oh, that was very fast. Ooh. Can unplug my controller? I need full mobility. I love her toe armor. Toe armor. How does one wear toe armor? Like, is it like toe socks, but armor? Like you slide it on, like a sock. Wee. Um, that looked like it was going to do a lot more than it did, and I got really scared for a second. Prosthetic limb. Is it on both her feet, though? Are both her feet fake? Oh, ow. Yeah, she's like, make sure you remember my name. Isn't it both her toes? She got fake toesies. At least they put the spawn really close. Yay. We're gonna be here a while. It'll be great. Oh, she's running this time. She's zooming. Storms around back. Well, that didn't stagger it this time. Rude. I don't know who her moves well enough yet. I've not seen enough. She has a lot of health though. I'm assuming she has more than one phase because she's like the optional hard boss. Oh. Well, I assume that's her one shot too. That's probably her one-shot ability. It's like that other um, boss that I fought in one of the jails. Is that what it was? I'm trying to remember. Wasn't there a boss that did something like that? Mm. Oh boy. Okay. Yeah, it's Genichiro. Genichiro. Black knife? Yeah! I us see, I remember it. Oh, of course I'm good. Whee! Oh, oh. Electo, that one. The fact that she heals, oh my god, is so evil. Yeah, I think for that one, I either ran very far or I rolled into it. I like how she walks away after, like she's going somewhere. You're just gonna go sit down.
feel so slow against her. I go fast. Zoom. She is so bad. That's a cool little kick. Can I make her bleed if I hit her now? Maybe. That's the one that I can't stagger her on, and she keeps doing it when I jump on her. <laughs> she really waits for you to do something, doesn't she? You sneaky bugger. Do something. Like what? Is she not? Okay. <laughs> Is she broken? That shows you how much she goes off of your attacks and like what you do. Oh, it keeps going. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. I didn't think it kept going. I was like, ah, I can oat oh, roll it. No, okay. Yeah, that's how you know when a boss actually. Like, what's the word? choreographs off your abilities like your button inputs she can tell she knows what you did but i seem like i'm lagging hello it goes it goes it goes so you pretty much have to get behind her or run forever input reading that one you can tell because she just doesn't move if i don't move Oh my god. <laughs> I just saw her butt. Her butt went through her dress. Booty. Cheeks. We're gonna be here a while. If I get your snacks. Cheek. Guess I could. What was Lord's aid again? What did, why do I have you? What are you? What are you? I think my Elgato's pooping its pants a little bit too. Everything's scared. There we go. Dumpy. Um, what was I checking? Oh, with the Lord. Lord's aid. I did not mean to do that. May as well use it if we got it. Probably hit her twice, but, uh, at least it looks cool. She regens so much health, too. Crazy. I'm just gonna try to hit her more than she hits me. Whenever I'd sunlock her, she would immediately whip out the waterfall dance. It's been the win. Oh. Are you winning? Hey, Belle. Um, I hit her. 
She animation cancels out of staggers, just like now. Yeah. It's like my weakness. Two-handed sword? Try to stagger this. I think putting the buff on will help me a little bit, at least. May as well use it. I literally press every button but it every single time. There we go. Shows how much I use magic. But I did make her uh, stagger. Stagger tees. <laughs> exactly. What? I can't, I can't knock you out when you're in the air like a bird? I think I'm dead. I think I'm dead. Nope. Oh god. Yes! <laughs> Is that an insta-kill? Okay, I'm glad I died to that one. I like that one. The roundhouse is an automatic stun lock cancel. Roundhouse kick. That one was good. I'm glad I died to it. Wait, what? Ah! Instant sit down. I could die happy now. Stab me, mummy! Boop. Boop. Did it! First try! Wow! Just take a seat. No, she definitely has to have more than one phase. She hasn't even used Scarlet Raw yet. You have to. That's your name. That's your job. Brought mommy. Oh, that was a different one. She didn't go forward. Or straight. A little dipsy doodle. I guess that shows you how much your health bar doesn't mean shit. She just two shots me and I think my health bar is massive, but people say that they have way more health than me, so. We will get her. She will fall. Maybe not today, maybe not tomorrow, but eventually. Oh, I tried to debate her, it didn't work. I just have no idea how many times she's gonna attack, I think is the problem. Like when I think she's done, she not. Hit her twice. I think. No, three times. I wonder. I wonder, does she have any summons that she talks to? I don't think if there's any, like, lore summons probably not at least not that i have oh unless you summon her i feel like she's just op though rollo calm down there sephiroth Kinda wanna do a flame blood blood flame blood build. Seems very cool. Oh we both dodging? Dodging? Smash. Oh. Blade blood 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 blood. <laughs> Did it! So you can stagger her. Good to know. Good to know. Nice bone. Oh. Uh oh. <laughs> what the fuck? 
Okay, so she doesn't just go in a line. She just, like, freaking loses her shit. Okay. She's like, predict this! Okay. My thought process there was if she goes in a straight line, um, just go behind her, and then you would think the momentum, she can't stop, she just keeps going forward, but uh, she can stop, and she can turn. A little spinny, backwards spinny. Very elegant. Dark Souls, nobody abides by logic. What's logic? Physics don't apply here. Yeah, I don't know about that one. I assume you just panic roll. Unless there's an actual way to dodge it. Very well. I feel like you have to unlock your camera. If you're locked onto her, then you just spin in place and it doesn't work very well. <laughs> panic dodging is a strat. Roll, scream. Really? The more you scream, the better your chance of dodging is. I made a blade. Oh, we fucked. We dead. She's like, by the way, I healed. Slam water on desk. Boom. Lock on is the real enemy. I know. Oh no, I forgot. Okay, she just walks. She's fine. Oh, she run it! Game has been actively punishing and discouraging panic. Then here comes Melidia. Actually, though, all the other slow, like, I'ma get you bosses, and then her. The complete opposite. Like, the I'ma definitely get you if you don't scream. I don't know how I staggered her that one time very quickly. Oh. See, I keep thinking I can go behind her, because usually when bosses do something in one direction that much, you can, but uh. I don't know. I'm just fat. I think it's almost worth it to take off all my armor and just kind of go like zoom. So I'm gonna die in one hit, anyways. Why not be naked? Kind of like Demon of Hatred? How he was faster or how he was just like massive? Or slow? He was just very different. He felt Dark Souls. Oh, yeah, that's true. He's pretty much Dark Souls 3, yeah. Just get the hecky away from her. That's a strat. Like 
that one? I don't know. I knew I was gonna hit her before she hit me, but... Ran no way. Yeah, and then she just heals off of you, so it's kind of like... I use this, are you gonna start running? I was like, I'll just roll. Ow. Um. I'm gonna try something. Let's see. How much faster am I? I don't think I'm much faster. Let's see how fast I get one shot. Like they nerfed her healing. She heals quite a bit. I mean, she only hit me once and she healed like pretty much the three hits I did to her. What? How'd they miss? What? <laughs> Fast. A speed. Zoom! She just healed, like, everything back into it. Whee! Oh, wait, what? Wait, what? 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 Did she just finally... Tick after I hit her? Come here. I feel like it may be faster, uh, but obviously the damage, I think I can only get hit by that twice when I'm dead, so. It was just a blood flame buildup. That's the first time I've seen it tick that far after. Now I have to find my armor again. Is I wearing these ones? I think I was wearing silver ones. Yeah. And, uh, face mask for added edge. I can't remember if there's a spell or something that you throw that disables healing in this game. But she's technically a life stealing, so I don't know if it would work. Hee <laughs> hee. God. I don't know how I feel about this ability. I don't know how I feel. Is there like a secret to dodging it? <laughs> or is it just run? Good luck, have fun. I gotta try unlocking, but. Very hard to remember to unlock your camera in that moment when you're already like, well, shit, I think I'm dead. Mostly running. So I can, like, beat her up if she's close to me, but... Oh, she does bleed pretty easily. That's good. Good to know. Like, can I outrun it? 
Okay, so it seems like if I see her doing it, I can, like, pre-run. <laughs> Check the let me solo you. Oh, she's pretty much just full health again. That's nice. Really? Is she doing it again? Like right on top of me? Oh, okay. So I guess it just depends where she uses it. Because if I'm already on top of her, you're... Pretty much dead. It's like, what am I gonna do? Where am I gonna go? Nowhere. I guess the strat is get good at dodging every other ability, and then if that one happens, it's RNG whether it's in a good spot or not. I do very much hate- oh god, that was unlucky. I haven't seen that one enough to know what it is. It's like, la la la, are you gonna use it? I'm scared. I'm scared. Okay, okay. I stay over here? Yeah, you lay down, it just goes over your head. It'd be hilarious, actually. Oh, I knocked her in the air. I think she was gonna do it. No, I think she was gonna do her other thing. Can he knock her out of the air before she does it? gonna try to get her more than she gets me. No. Use all my health pots in time for your phase two. You're definitely gonna have two health bars too, aren't you, you dirty lady? Wish I had stamina, that'd be cool. Are you for real? Oh, she's dead. No. No, she's not dead. Well, I know my strat now. Just beat the shit out of her <laughs> until she, uh, dies. I think she actually had one health. Rewind the video. Ma, oh, look. Can you throw something at her to knock her out of it? I don't know if that would work. Maybe just the two-handed sword. The unga bunga smash is usually very effective for knocking people out of the sky. What? What are you doing? What? What? It's always the last hit for me. Oh. Okay, so I can hit her when she's flying? Jumping attack? Yeah, I guess since they have the one HP mechanic for the uh, for us, the bosses also seem to get it. There's no way it's not a thing. I think they do it for the shock factor because you think the boss is dead, so you don't attack again and you just kind of like wait and then it just kills you. Oh, that's nice. I guess I have my crystal darts. <laughs> Oh, 
That one I still seem to have problems dodging, but... Uh-oh. I think my tactic is gonna be either be far enough away or knock her out of it. But I don't know if I have to actually get a crit on her to do it. We'll find out! Take a seat. Oh, I forgot to put my thing on. Wait, 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 wait. Lady, wait. Like, I feel like if you summon against her, it makes it so much easier, because she doesn't really do AoE. Even if I summon my ashes. I don't think I'll even summon ashes for this fight. Maybe if the second phase is like redonkulous, but. I definitely have the jumping attack. Wait, how'd I hit her the one time? Like before she jumped up? You're too high! <laughs> I'm gonna try throwing something at her. <laughs> it's gonna happen. Let's see. I'm gonna take that off. Um... See, when I, uh, Reupload this spot. I'll replace all these attempts with a uh, blank attempts later. Oh, I should summon the bird. Let's see what the bird does. I highly doubt. Oops. Oh, I use it twice and I can summon the bird. I just want to see him. You were using a. How would you kill her with like a ultra great sword? Can you just stagger her longer? I guess. I feel like it'd be very hard to hit her. No. I tried. Just beat her to pulp with a big hammer and she just like did she get staggered pretty badly so i was gonna say chasing her around with a two-hander like a massive one how do you catch her i want to try summoning the bird let's see what the bird looks like is it just like a it's a bird Look at him! What does he do? What do you do, bird? Bird, what do you do? Bird one-shots her. 25 damage! That's hilarious! <laughs> I think he's dead! The game plan is keep out my darts and see if I can knock her down. Like, I'm kind of the awkward in between. My sword isn't massive, but I'm not quick enough for it to be small. Small sword. I feel mad. Why are you so mad, Olsen? Your jumpy attack. I want to try something. Do it. Do it. For chicken nuggies. No, my chicken. Or just keep doing that. That's fine. Mm. 
knife warm. I just wanted to try to throw a knife at her. Let me throw a knife at you, please. I thought the bird was gonna have like an ability or something, but no, it just flies at people. It doesn't even have knives on its feet. Her bleed resistance doesn't seem very good. Oh. I almost outran all of it. That last part, that was a little spicy. It would be nice if I could be close enough to her to knock her out of the air when she does it, but oh my god, why? I guess the goal is just live. What? What? <laughs> what just happened? Beard. Give me a little boop. I think she was like half going up in the air and then just disappeared because she like reset to be back on the ground. <laughs> Can you imagine she's saying my name's Melania and she's like flying through the air? That'd be actually hilarious. Me dead. Bye. Yeah, Only lesson I'm learning here is her name is Melania. Lady Mikla. Why don't you go get him? Well, I'm think I think from lore, didn't Mog like steal Mikla away? I don't think Mog's supposed to have him. Stoish him. Hey. Kidnapping. Mog. Can't just go kidnap God. He's very cool. <laughs> I hit her! I did hit her! I hit her foot! Yeah, I think DLC's gonna involve Mikola and maybe going into his dream world. Like in his little egg. Yeah, there definitely has to be more about him because he's too important of a character to just like. It shows Mog carrying Mikola. Yeah, Mikola's a little baby. I don't understand how he's so big in the egg, but like, like Mog's big. But Mikola looks like he's very small. I thought he didn't age. Maybe he grows, but he doesn't age? I don't know. I don't know what's going on there. Mikola's nightmare. I hit her, but it didn't work. I don't know, I prefer that he's a big mystery. He just seems so important. I, I like his character design too. Like his, uh, sword. His aesthetic, I guess, as a whole. His purpose. A 
big mystery, get it? Because he's small in the opening, but he's big and we don't know why. <laughs> being placed in the Hallig tree may have attempted to fix his curse. Trying to fix him. Maybe it succeeded, but then he died or something. I don't know right now. So I think for me to knock her out of the air completely, I have to like get a crit. Big boy crit. She dodge. Oh. I live. I think my game plan is just hit her more than she hits me in a row. We just go for it. What are you gonna do? Uh oh. Of course. Of course we are. Almost. The idea of Gwyn's firstborn being a mystery made it intriguing until he answered it. He's like, he's nameless, but Scarlet Rot God. Scarlet Rod God? Rot God. They left him nameless. True, he is still nameless. Can you imagine his name's just like Jim? Miyazaki's one of the few authors like David Lynch that un understores the The question is interesting, the answer is not. True, until they make Dark Souls 3. Scarlet Rod. Yeah, I like that they leave a lot for speculation. I mean, that's the best part about Soulsborne lore in, in general. That makes some people mad. Oops. Or even if, like, I feel like if they're gonna answer some questions, it's best that it's in a DLC. So then it gives the community and people enough time, especially with Elden Ring, because it's so massive to piece it together themselves, and then they can give, like, a solid answer. For, like, certain things. Like, I like the Nameless King because I like that it confirms he betrayed Gwyn, and, like, here he is. Even though he was alive, like, he could have helped Gwyn somehow, but, you know, he was like, nah. Oh, I missed. I think Millennia's always had rot. I think that was Mikola's whole thing was he was trying to get rid of it. Is Mikola uh, Mikola must be older. But his curse is he's forever. Young or unaging? Well, I guess same thing. I know that much. Are you freaking kidding me? Millennia's. It's so hard with all the M names. It's like make a map, ma Mog, Mark. Okay, well, it's good that Mog and Morgot are brothers, like twin brothers. Like, okay, your names are too close to not be like brothers. Oh, she did a little spinny. Just the tip. Hit 
hit her on the back swing. That move is actually Genichiro's move, is it not? Way up to away. I can't remember what it's called. Every time I get closer, I'm like, is she gonna do it? See, she did it! Makes you super cautious of this whole fight. <gasps> I got her! My plan! It worked! Okay, now what? Run! Run! Wait, are you not dead? Hello? Does she have one health? She has one health. I hate this game. Why? Why? What? Oh my god. My god! Uh oh, the woodpecker. I might have to mute my mic for this. That woodpecker sounded like it was a freaking dragon landing on my chimney. Uh oh. She has a face. That's creepy. I hope it was an actual dragon. Oh, it's one of those flowers. Right now she's gonna be all badass. Oh, the butterflies are cool. What? She naked. She naked. So pretty. What are you gonna do? <laughs> oh, there's the Scarlet. Nice. Aki. I like how her, she actually had like a little belly roll there. I like that. And what are you gonna do? What are you gonna do? Kill me? Rot panties? <laughs> Oh no. Like when she bent, they could have made it just like straight. But no, she actually like had a little tummy roll. She turned into a big mommy. I mean, she's already big mommy. Bigger mommy. Now I know my game plan. Rot row. I think we're in a corner. Well, that's cool. I hope it explains something about the tree after. Like, why does the tree have a face? I don't like that. That was super cool. For killing me? For her turning into a butterfly. 
I want to know how the butterflies survive the rot. Are they rot butterflies? Special butterflies. You run. It's gonna pop. Really? She didn't pop there? Okay, there we go. Tried to hit her. Yeah, I guess if she's above me, my best chance is just to hit her a few times. It must have to be like a critical hit. Because I tried a jumping two handed attack and it didn't knock her out of it either. Just did damage. And I know I hit her because it did damage. We're gonna be all night. I'm excited to fight Godfrey too. Godfrey? Godfrick. Godrick? Who is it? Triggered the bleed and it knocked her out of it? Oh my god. Is that what it was? You can't even hit her out of it? Maybe I could, uh, oh. Thought maybe I could stagger her out of it? You might be able to. Maybe. Maybe not. God Frey win, Rick. <laughs> Actually, though. God win? God Rick? God... Gwyn? Gwyn? Gwyn Rick? Gwyn Wick. Ah. No. I want to hit her one more time. She's not super tanky. I think it's just the fact that you have to be super careful. God boy. Gold geode fray. <laughs> I'm excited to learn this family tree. I don't know what the heck's going on with this family. I mean, they're gods. Knowing gods, they do some weird shit in their family lineage. Like Greek family. Everybody's related to their sister and like. Married to their sister. And... Radigan? I don't think we've actually seen Radigan. We've heard of him, but we haven't seen him. Well, Radigan's the dad of Radon, I know that. Do something! Do something! Are oh, you bitch! No! <laughs> Can I hit her while she's doing this? That's okay. Yeah, as long as you don't say anything, it's all good. I haven't seen anything about the ending or like late lore. Pretty much at this point, I think I've seen everything I can see. Except, I think she. Melania is the last optional boss I have that's like a big boss, and then I am at Godfrey? Lion Man. Back in the castle. Yeah, I do need to do more NPC quest lines for sure. I don't know how I staggered her so easily that one time, too. Like that. I was lucky, I think. I think I'm dead. Giga Chad. Yeah, 
know, when I get to the last boss of games or like he seems kind of last boss-ish. So I'm like, either you're the last boss or you go straight into another boss. So really all I have to do is lots of difficult bosses now, which I'm here for. I want ice cream. Let's go! Oh, the Volcano Manor? Yeah, because I, uh... I killed their god. <laughs> they're like, oh, we could all be great at friends. And I'm like, BRB. And then I went and killed their god. And they're like, okay, we need to go. And I was like, wait! I was just exploring, I'm sorry. Yeah, that'll, that'll be my new game plus uh, mandatory thing. I think I'm dead. Wait, what? I did it! I lived! You see that? Ma, get the camera! I lived! Do it again. Okay. I really like Rikard's boss fight. That was cool. I think that's one of my favorite like gimmick weapon boss fights in the Soulsborne series. She's gonna do it. I know she is. I can smell it. I can smell it. Like, Yorms is cool, but this isn't, like, crazy. His is more, like, lore-friendly. Oh my god. <laughs> yeah. Like, I love Yorm. I love lore Yorm's lore and, like, the the Katarina onion bro. Yeah. He's good for, like, story reasons. He's kind of just, like, a wholesome boss. Do you want to watch this again? The fact that it pans on the tree. Interesting. Interesting. He's not as good as the original Onion Bro. He was my OG Onion Bro. He was the first one I saw. I saw Reverse Onion Bro. So when she fought Radon. I guess she got to her second phase, and then she summoned the flower, and that's when he got fucked up. The scarlet blue flowers once more. Oh, her hair is in her wings. Interesting. Cool. It's like the Pooh Bear. You will witness true horror. Yes, mommy. She has no eyes. Interesting. See, makes me think of uh, the maidens because they all have their eyes covered too. All the women always have no eyes. I'm a, I'm a head out. I'm a head out. I'm a head out. Duh. Wait, did she start with, like, a little bit less health? Mommy? Sorry. So I guess the first challenge is avoiding that uh, attack. Eighty percent Whoa, she cool? She mommy. We're gonna be here a long time. Just wanna go full on Gabunga mode. No. I 
I just want to know how the butterflies live. Rot proof. Oh, mommy! That was rude. Purple Emperor is rare among butterflies. It avoids flowers, preferring rotting animal corpses, feces, mud puddles, and even human sweat. Butterflies are weird. There are some butterflies that are just like, yeah, I'm just here, I'm just vibing. And there's some butterflies that are like, I eat dead corpses and like live inside people's eyes. Oh, okay. yay! Nature's metal, actually, though. She's gonna do it. I know she is. Mommy! Mom! I guess I could take away the throwing knives. They're not gonna help me when she lives with one health. I'm gonna have zero health pots for the next part, but that's fine. Uh oh. I try to hit her when she's doing this. Nope. Can't. Can't happen. Is that what she had? Purple emperors? I think our butterflies are all different colors. But maybe it's like related. It'd be interesting if it was like a red butterfly. But you can find red butterflies in the game, too. I don't think there are- are there any purple butterflies in this game? It would be a crafting item, right? No. I thought it would be. Purple flowers? The purple ones? Oh, the red ones, yeah. If I hit her four times, she's staggered. Ooh. Yeah, she healed a lot there. I lived. Spin is so cool. Punch, just Falcon Puncher. <laughs> okay, I just want to get to your next phase so I can, um. I can try to survive that one attack. Right at the beginning. Oh, the kick. Not the kick. Oh, no. Um, so her big attack she does in her second phase. If I'm under her, can she go directly down? It seems like she kind of goes at an angle, but, uh... Maybe she just can't go down. Maybe she has too much... She has to go too fast. I just sit under her, like, on my chair. I'm fine. Yeah, the tree is, like, a girl. A woman.
I was too close. Hey, Wolfenstein. How are you? So, what's her name? Millicent? Wasn't she trying, or she wasn't trying, but, um, creepy old man was trying to turn her into one of those flowers? Because we see one of those flowers, like, back a bit from here. Was she trying to turn her into, like, a goddess of rot or something? Oh, so another G! Gauri. Gau Gauri. Oh. He was trying to turn her into a flower, I believe? Is that how that works? <laughs> you just turn somebody into a flower? Gary? Goddamn Gary! I wish I wasn't already swinging there. Oh, well, we did. Damn, Gary. I don't know how or why. So I would think if you don't finish her quest line, do you find her as a flower later? Because she pulls it out because you do her quest line, like the needle. <laughs> Is it so simple as to put a needle in somebody and they turn into it? Gary can give you more insight as you progress her quest. Oh, did I miss things? I thought I was pretty good with the quest. You gave her the arm. Gary. His name is now Gary. makes her use her happy no fun time uh, ability. You can come back to him if you want some more lore dumps during her quest. Oh. I just didn't go talk to him enough because I think I just went back to him and I killed him. <laughs> I was like, bye. Using needle so she can make the journey to the high chain and become the new goddess of rot. Yeah. I told Gary to get lost. He did not deserve to live anyways. Maybe she does that automatically at like half health. Wait, I almost lived. I made it to the last one. Second to last one. Okay. And how does a needle do that? I guess he'll give me more lore if I actually speak to him instead of just murdering him. He doesn't seem like a good guy though. I don't trust him. I don't trust Gary. Gary Y, the Elden Ring version of Barry Y. Baked on his mind. You can see her undies. So I think at this point, like once you feel comfortable with the first part of the fight, I wouldn't feel guilty summoning an ash spirit just so I can survive through this phase or get through it faster because 
feel like the second phase is gonna take forever. I know she is so fast. It always starts with the same attack, but she didn't do it this time. No, she didn't. Oof. That health bar. I love when your health bar just goes from like 100 to zero, that it takes like a few seconds. So it goes like, wee. Need more caffeine. And donuts. Donuts are ma mandatory. Yeah, I think you can pick up the butterflies, right? Maybe they turn into a different item or something. Some when you're bored of running around for an opening. That makes sense. Because yeah, a lot of this fight now is just either go for it or kind of be careful because if you use that ability, you're pretty much dead. If it happens to be in a bad spot. Who's got the one health savior now? I dodged that because I was short. I'm dead. Just sent you another clip if you... I'll do the other two later. Oh yeah, thank you, Ruby. No rush. No rush at all. Be here. Forever. <laughs> then it can also become boring because of how encounters can be trivialized. True. I wouldn't want to use it on second phase. Are you alive? There's a 1 HP like gimmick that I believe it's not every time, but sometimes it will leave you with one health, but it also does it on bosses too. Use it on, use Tish on this fight, isn't she? She's like OP OP, right? On bosses, it's not fun because you'll think the boss is dead and you'll wait. And then they'll just run at you like nothing ever happened. And you're like, wait, what? Her sword is longer than I think all the time. Ah! No! No, no, no. No, 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 no. Hit me. The woodpecker landed on my chimney but didn't do anything. Win. It actually sounded like a dragon. <laughs> it sounded massive. Would have been an eagle though. I like the idea of dragon. She's gonna do it. The second I overcommit. That was good. That was a good time. That was good timing. I didn't know where to roll there. That's not bad. Bad, bad time. Apply. Yeah, I feel like if you did this without any bleed or anything, it'd be very hard. Oh no. Looks like she's gonna go way farther than she is. Tales of Arise? I didn't play the- I haven't played a Tales game before. But it looked really good. I think Krim did. She's gonna have the 1 HP law right for it. It's gonna happen. Nope. Okay, good. Okay. Do we wanna see this one more time? 
You want to see us again? We're going to see a lot. Did her arm fall off? No. I'm sorry. She take a nap. Because this is the Halleck tree. And didn't uh, Mikola make the Halleck tree? What, did he carve his sister into it? <laughs> Now, let's see if I survive this. I want to see one ability. Just one. Other than that one. That one doesn't count. I believe. It's all different color butterflies. How many butterflies? Well, if we're down fodder like this, then I don't really blame him for getting fucked up. Now, rot. She's got a nice figure. Nicola's like, I'm gonna build my own earth tree with blackjack. <laughs> okay, time to see if I live! Okay, going right under is the way to go. Oh, it looks like I can attack for a while there. Good to know, good to know. Oh, she does the same thing. This is good. This is good. So it seems like the same fight, just with Rot. And then the nuke mechanic at the beginning, which I think I just have to go under her. I don't think it even needs to add rot because I'm dead anyways. <laughs> it seems like overkill. Because if it hits me, I guess if you have enough HP, you can maybe live through it. But like, I'm gonna die anyways. The rot is just a little added sprinkles on top. Like I die, I'm on the ground. She just like sprinkles a little bit of rot on me. Okay. Weird flex, but okay. I know she does that for sure when she hits half health, so I have to be careful with that. She seems to do it twice. One at every quarter health, maybe? I don't know. I don't know if it can actually happen on its own or if it happens at different increments. I want to try a giant two-hander and just see if I can bonk her what it does. <laughs> I'm tempted, but I think I'd have to respec. Usually does around 70. Yeah, it seems around 70, 50, and then whatever she wants after. Whee! Yeah, I think it's back like where the staircase is. There's another one of those flowers. It's actually the only one I've seen. But wasn't there a dead person in it? So maybe she turned into the flower. Maybe lots of people turn into the flowers. Lots of the girls, but they don't actually become the goddess of rot because that's probably not how it works if she was born like this. Just an assumption. Is there a sword that steals life too? There is, isn't there? <laughs> so couldn't you just like 
keep slapping each other <laughs> and keep healing. I think there is a katana that life steals. Or is it a ability that you put on your katana for weapon? There is. I have a big bonk sword. Big, big bonk weapon. The biggest bonkiest weapon we got. Curved great sword? No, no, no. I want to try twin blade. Twin blade's so cool. The finger. I hate how the finger says it's warm. Jesus. Oh. Oh my god, that is so cool. What is this considered? Colossal weapon. It's not considered anything. Just big. <laughs> Intelligent. Use the basic twin blade. How many are there? Where are they? How many do I have? Weapon art is sick though. This bonk class pack. Where? Where, where? I like how there's heavy thrusting sword too. Heavy thrust. Where arch? I got three. Twin knight swords, godskin peeler, and gargabagarbada. Twin blades. I don't know if I can use the weapon art on it because I don't have enough. Um, don't have enough intelligence. My girl just drools. She's not very smart. Yeah, I can't. I think so. I mean, we're talking great swords. That's pretty cool, too. There's a lot of cool great swords. Radon's swords are really pretty. They all require like faith, except for this one. Berserker man. I already have the sword that life steals. Is it the katana? I think it's the katana, right? Under great swords? Oh, the suck blade. This one. That's the one I was thinking of. Upon defeating an enemy, oh. Oh, wait, no. No, the skill. There you go. You can duel her with this. And then you can just keep out healing each other's attacks. <laughs> I want to kind of try to bonk her, but I'd have to go level this up, I would assume. Let's see. We'll do a little bonk. Ah! Hey, Malice, how are you? Boom. I did no damage. Oh my god, I'm fat rolling. <laughs> Can't even hit her. This is actually a tactic. She won't have any idea why you're moving so slow. Oh damn, it does stay her a lot. She's like, why are you so slow? <laughs> I didn't think about that. How am I? I am laying in the flowers with my lady. Yeah, I think I think the way I got my builds going good. We'll make it work. It'll happen eventually. We haven't even been here that long. Maybe an hour. What of hours later? I'm not even phased. Look at me. Does this look like the face of somebody? Face of somebody that's bothered. I'm 
unbreakable charm. Oh no, 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 no. <laughs> the second you did that. Can you knock her out of the air by hitting her? Like if you had a great sword, let's say, can you stagger her with the great sword? You would have to be able to, right? Not even phase in the slightest. Not at all. Nothing here. No problems. At all. Only dreams. Not sure about her there. Or if you like jumped with the hammer. Just yeet. Yay! Or, aren't there like the giant great bows? Can you snipe her out of the air? That's what they're for, right? Killing dragons. You can kill a dragon, but it can't. Shoot her down from the air. And for certain attacks, but she does have paper on her. Cheating. Axe. She's probably gonna do it next attack. Just baseball. Just shoot him across the sky. Bye! I know you're gonna do it. When? Get around. Problem is, she doesn't use it right away either. She waits. I went very far there. You didn't use it! Like what? Hello? There we go. Did it live? I did not live. I did not. I think that ability is the most annoying part. Not just- not because it kills you and it's hard to dodge. But because you pretty much have to wait for it, because you know it's coming at least three times. You just sit there and you're like, eh? Eh? Are you gonna do it? You need to get so close to her to make her do anything. I think that's another way summons would help a lot, because A, she can go after the summon, even if it's a little skeleton. And, uh, also they can prompt her to attack. You have to get very close to her to actually make her do something. have to back her into the corner and hope she does it? Okay. Too late. <laughs> hmm. Who thinks skeletons can defeat her? I don't know. Maybe. Maybe not. I feel like an archer would be OP against her. Let's test it out. I mean, I won't beat the first, second phase anyway, so let's see. Will she go after you, or will she go after me? Should have done my Oh, I can't. Right. She's going to straight up destroy you. Elden Lords. Doesn't do that much damage, but he seems very upset with her. She's got the jukes. She can't dodge skeletons, though. Oh, I 
I was one-handing. Why was I one-handing? See, she's gonna- Oh, she went after me! I thought she was gonna go after them! I avoid summons on her after the first few tries. She could just heal off them so much. Wait, she can heal off them? Oh no. I never thought about that. Can she heal off the skeletons? They're dead. We must test this theory. How she- How- How? I can't... I can't heal off something that's dead. We'll see. Go oh, boys. Probably shouldn't summon them against the door. Look at me. Get her, boys! <laughs> I love them! <laughs> oh my gosh, you can heal them! No! Great. She seemed to just go after me there, too. How does she heal off dead skeletons? Where's the logic? Explain. <laughs> so they do absolutely nothing. But, to make more exciting. I think it's more fun. And if she ever ends up with one HP, you know who's gonna execute her? The boys. It'll be the boys. I like how I saw the bird. <laughs> the bird was so useless. Poor bird. What are you gonna do? Oh, she sees them. We just like keep smacking her, right? I'm gonna go this way. She went after the boys, but she's healing. This is not good. <laughs> she's gonna full health off them. <laughs> it's just watching them beat the shit out of her is kind of amusing. But yeah, she keeps healing off them. Not convenient. Yeah, we need the grievous wounds. And I can't even apply my blade. Skeleton bros, come on. Get her! <laughs> Go! We can stagger her. Just hit her. Just hit her. Come on. Oh. I like to do so much damage. No! But she can only target one of them. Well, no, she can get both. Okay. But she keeps hitting him. Yeah, I don't think summons are worth it. Unless you have a really strong summon. They just- how do they heal up skeletons? I wanna know. Is she a necromancer? Well. The mimic copies your exact build, right? Whoa, 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 okay, I'm dead. Bye. Good night. I lived! Nope. Mommy! <laughs> Just kill me. Just end me. That was the first time she started with a grab. She's changing it up. I don't want to see Blythe in the screen. The... the Death screen, whatever. Transition screen. Makes me sad. He died like 18 years ago in our playthrough. Oh. Uh oh. Mom. It was a wee. 
me, babe. My pupper. He was the best boy. And now he's gone. He's gone so fast. This Macarena? Macarena! <laughs> What's her new name? Gary and Macarena. I love the dramatic, like, walk into the fog gate when I'm doing that. Macaron. Like the concept of a wolf being the guardian of royalty and how they repeated it over and over. No, oh, I love him. It's like the lion versus the wolf, pretty much, which is like, you know, sun, moon. Lion is the sun, wolf is the moon. Oh! At least a means of dodging the obliteration has been found. Run! <laughs> Get lucky and run. Yeah, this game is just really cats versus dogs. I lived! 1 HP! I did it! Try sip chrome wolf running and bleed. True. Line of wolf is a jar jar martini. <laughs> jar jar martini. The new one. Holy, oh, that does a lot of damage. So then this fight would be one that you actually benefit on uh, bringing another person instead of uh, Ash Summon, because Ash Summon small brain. Ash Summon just sit there and take and giveth heal. I did think there was something you could throw. Maybe I'm thinking of dumb. Can you throw poop at her? Then she can't heal. I throw shit at her. What will happen? Try again. Let's go, bros! And I can't use my blood flame. The loathsome dung eater. I think there is a craftable item? I don't wanna try. I wanna see what's going on. I craft poop. Google it. <laughs> I don't think she's having fun. We stagger her enough, she can't really attack. But her healing's not even healing, it's like life steal. Yeah, so she's already full health off them. Boys, you gotta stop getting hit! Any pots? I have not. Any pot man? They're killing her. Look at them go. Uh oh. Look at her health. <laughs> Hilarious. Oh. Still have blood loss. I don't even know if I can summon the black knife. I don't think I have enough um, FP. Open a pot! <laughs> Her 
her talks are really anime. I know. He's pretty. Isn't the black knife kind of like lore? Oh, the weapon. Like the... Uh, like Malakath's blade? Or are you talking about a different one? Where am I going? A dagger. Do I have it? I do not. That one's interesting. Why happens if you use rot against her? Is she weak to rot? Oh, rot the rot? Oh, I was gonna check. Can I make poop in a pot? Rot pot. F poop in a pot! Deadly poison. Volcano in a pot. Cursed blood. Gold poop in a pot. Yeah, sorry. Bad. And then you can put it on a string. Poop on a pot. There's nothing that I was thinking of. Are these just like buffs, the meat? Boost focus. Poo poo pot on a string. Someone comes into the stream not knowing anything about like from soft games and their obsession with poop. Sorry, the what? You know. Poo poo pot on a string. Just a tip. Every time. Pee poop poop poop. No. 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 Why does it go so well until it doesn't? I feel like she's gonna use it. Oh god, of course I heal. I had a ting a tingle in my toes. I was right. Now I have no mouse pad. I just realized that. I wanna get that tubey butt mouse pad. I should make a butt mouse pad of my character. Hmm. Ha, <laughs> Google. How hard is it to make a booty mouse pad? Owie. Can confirm. Pretty comfortable. They are! A <laughs> Levi butt pad. I saw it the berserk expedition exhibit thing uh they made one of guts like an official merch yeah i have a chiaki one i'm attacking the titan levi that's great yeah booby mouse pads they don't discriminate there's boys and girls and there's booties and uh not booties Is it Guts booty? No, it's his chest. It's his pecs. Pop into your butt pad. Oh my god. Is there one? <laughs> Amazing. I think I've seen it, actually. I'd be surprised if there wasn't a pop in your, like, pecs one, too.
Oh, oh, bye. I feel like I'm not being aggressive enough. I just need to go for it. I gotta see if I can find it. Guts, booby, mouse pad. It was like an official arch. Oh yeah. Found it. There are a lot of mouse pads. Here, yeah, I'll just send you the link to the image. That's the image. Look at it. Glorious. It was like official merch. Did I close the window? Nope, it's just warm. Okay. Need to posture check myself, there we go. Usually when I fight a boss for a long time, I take a snake, a sneak, a snake break. I take a snack break and then I come back and I one shot it. So, you know, it definitely won't happen here, but. Hey, d is it Duddy? Do Duddy? Snake break. Wow, wow. You would think with that attack, if you were right on top of her, you would actually be okay because it doesn't hit the middle. Is that a thing? Is that how you dodge it? You dodge into it every time? She is Tornado. Speaking of tornado, I think there is a dragon boss I missed at the dragon place. I'll go back to the tornado. I'm gonna go super aggresso. Super espresso. Super mega dragon. Bigger than the other one I killed, the one that was in the dirt. Dirt dragon. I don't know the general's strat is. Like, I would just think you can go in the middle of it, right? I don't know. General strategy just run. Why did you swing that way? Atlas? I don't know, did I? Did I kill a dragon? I've killed a lot of dragons. Made a lot of hearts. Um, I don't know why she keeps swinging the wrong way, but... I'm gonna ambush you after the- Hmm. That's a good question. I think I almost have all the dragon abilities so far, unless it gives me a new one. i go check after. Got some more dragons. I went farther than I thought. My favorite thing about FromSoft games is when you are suddenly getting the fight and then you don't. And then you just either you get tired. Hey, I can't get tired. I know there's a dragon boss in the, the sky. Yeah, I want her to do this ability because she just kind of like stands her out here. Oh, this is good. This is good. Like now for the life of me, it's like, can I get to the next phase? I don't know.
Probably not. Wee. Like, I feel like compared to her, God. Is it God Frey? Or God Rick? I think it's God Rick, right? I think he's gonna be easier compared to her. He just has a lot going on. Yeah, I got the lion guy. He's just chilling. I did not mean to swing. Oh my god, that damn it. God Frey. Oh. I don't know the difference between them. I cannot remember for the life of me. God Rick, God Frey, God Win. Win. No, God Rick was at the beginning. God Frey is at the end. God Win is somebody else, right? Geralt. Gary. Sorry. Winfrey. Winry. Sometimes she's just out of reach so I can hit her. It's like, no. Heels off the kick. Oh my god, hello. I'll go until I get too hungry and then need a snack break. Hey, Captain, how are you? This will definitely not be like a one, a one fight, one stream fight. Onion rings, I wish. I mean, when everything's on fire, you could probably make some onion rings. to be able to survive. She pretty much goes from one end of it to the other. Okay, okay. What's that range? Far. Far range. I was doing so well until I wasn't. Are sweaty. I blame it on my sweaty palms. It's that one swing that keeps going the other way! But she hit me still. So. Ah. This week, chrome spaghetti. Everything's spaghetti. And spaghetti. I'm spaghetti. Everybody spaghetti. At least it's a short run. I can't imagine if it was a long run. 
because it's lots of time to die. Demon Souls run. Talisman that doesn't get affected by uh, Scarlet Rod as much. Oh! Oh! Yes. Probably be useful for next phase. I probably have it. We got it recently. Let's see. I feel like that one's not going to do anything. Sorry, blessed do. Okay, I guess there's this too. When you get a crit, you restore HP. Poisoning a rot increases attack power. Is rot in the vicinity when she's not rotting? Blood loss in vicinity, does that mean in the area or it's happening? So if I'm inflicting blood loss on her, would that increase my attack power? Well, these are very interesting. Yes, but we just keep. I wonder if it'd be more worth it to wear like this one. Greatly increases attack power with successive attacks because I'm trying to do. Oh. I kind of want to see how much it does. Let's see. And what's considered successive? How many? More than two? Twelve? I'll be able to tell with the HP. Awkward. Oh, I heard a heal. That was like, what, three? How much did it heal? Did it even heal anything? <laughs> I don't think it did. I didn't see. Did anybody see? That's probably not worth it, because it probably won't save me. So I wonder if this would add more, or if this would add more. Try this. Answers jump attacks. Robustness. So many talisman. Try this one. I guess I should have saw the numbers without it on, but uh, it's fine. Hurt it a little bit. I was kind of right. So it seems the closer I stay to her, the better it is. 
Well, the center does seem safe. I guess that's like your last resort if you're not far enough away to begin with. Okay. And then we do also have the super flask, but I don't know. That would be worth it either. I have for dinner. Hmm. I feel like donuts. <laughs> donuts don't count as dinner. <laughs> yes, they do. This is true. Healed her a lot. Oh, I can see the attack buff. So it's like once bleed happens. I guess it's not applied, but. See, I almost lived. Getting there. Okay, so you can see when the buff is there. That's good. So you know it's working. I think that's the hardest thing with builds in this game is you don't know exactly what something does unless it has an indication like that. Or you can see your damage go up like a lot. Me to press that again. Wah. Spider with tea in my hand. I don't even need hands. Let me try talking to her. I did. She said no. Asked nicely too. But can't we just be friends? You're cool. Be my mommy. We can interrupt her uh, grabby grab. You have to be behind her in the middle. Definitely easy. Definitely. Does it look like my girl is crouching? Nope, she is not. The blood flame blade definitely helps a bit. If you didn't use it, I don't even know. I would do like no damage here. Oh. Okay. 
do a tactical approach. Did I ever finish the quest of that beast guy who wants the... Um, I think the undead rot things, whatever they're called, the hearts? Or do I still have more to give him? I did fight him, kind of, rarely. Not yet. Do I still have more boatmans to find? Oh, so basically the last one was the last boatman. Wait, did I not go back to him? Maybe I haven't even gone back to him since then. Must have. Well, I'm good. I did. Not much of a quest, just find them all and he gives a reward. I fought all the bulk boys. That's what they're called, death root. And I still need to find more of those Shabribri grapes to give to the girl, because I think she's waving at Linaria still. You have to actually apply bleed like that. Not just like a little bit of bleed. A big bleed. She seems faster now, or am I slower? I'm trying to remember all the stuff that I haven't done. I think there's a few more dragons. I'm dragonborn. like that ability or not. I feel like the fight would be more fun if you didn't just instantly die to it. Maybe the second phase is a little less, but probably not. He's very cool, though. Oh. Oh. Every time. And what was the other thing? Yeah, I haven't found another- are they actually called Shabriri Grapes, or are they called something else? I thought they were called Shabriri Grapes. Ability you use in Nier. Life steal with the anime sword swings. Oh yeah, there was a weapon in Nier. I can't remember what they're under. The grapes. So I keep getting those things that look like them, but they're not. And I think they'd be in here, right? Like they're considered key items. I keep thinking that where are they? These things are them. I 
I need to, I think I need to find like at least one more. My hands are getting tired, so she's getting faster than me. I'm too old. Donut needed? Yes, exactly. Donut is needed. Like, I know you're gonna use it, just do it. Are you serious? Like, why'd you ra why'd she randomly jump like that? Oh, ma'am! Can't fight properly on empty belly, true. Oh, that attack. I can't tell how I feel about that attack. I can't tell if it's really cool or just like a cheap way to make the fight end very quickly. Or to make the fight longer, technically, because if you're careful, you run around. I can't roll fast on a full belly. <laughs> yeah, roll around like a with the, the, uh, the fat god skin noble. That's me. That's gonna be me. Because it pretty much forces you to not be aggressive at certain points and to just wait for it to be used. Unless there's like a way to dodge it that I'm missing. And she ha you have to get so close to her for her to use it. able to heal in the middle of it. That was my other idea and it worked. I do like her kick. Yeah, if she misses one and you heal, maybe you can live. Oh, you're doing well. Here, take this. It definitely, it's that ability that uh, Genichiro uses, right? I think I should try the dragon bow against her and just snipe her. I think that's a good idea. Like, it's weird that she doesn't really react to you healing. Like, she won't actually attack you off you healing. I think that's the part that I don't like about it. She doesn't just use it. She uses it when you're really, really close to her, or else she'll just do nothing. Like, maybe if you throw stuff at her, it'll force her to attack, but... Throw some daggers at her. Oops, I did not mean to use that. What is this? It's a poison heal or something. Ah! My queen. Please. Has kicked me. Maybe she is going to eat your own.
It's funny how people stop talking about secure DLCs. Like, nobody's like, oh, we need another secure DLC. But people are still talking about Bloodborne. Like, dude. <laughs> like, we need Bloodborne too. Bloodborne PC. I thought I could hit her through that, but... I guess you could just wait this fight out forever. Oh god. Poison her. I am surprised they didn't get an actual DLC. Like, the only one they got is the gauntlet one, right? Even just to explore a character they kind of mentioned, but didn't show. Volleyball spiker? I know! Why not? <laughs> like with a hammer, you can just actually baseball her. Secure did do very well. I really like Secure. I like how different- it's kind of like the same reason I like Elden Ring. Elden Ring's open world, so it's a little different, but I like how different it felt, even though it still felt like a FromSoft game. Not just Dark Souls 4. But like nothing happened and you died? <laughs> you mean in Sekiro? Oh, and no one here. Yeah, this is fight in a nutshell. I'm here and then I'm dead. I hate how I can't stagger her on some abilities. Use it. Yep. <laughs> I definitely prefer the bigger from soft bosses. I feel like my favorite so far. I really like Morgoth or Margit. Is it Morgoth or Margot? I think it's Morgoth. Second one, when you fight him for the second time. I really like that fight. That fight was cool. I think that was my favorite fight so far. The gasoline sword guy. Morgoth, yeah. And my best bet with her is just keep keep smacking her. Hope for the best, run away. Gassy boy, his name is Morgan now. We got to the second phase, so many see she won't do anything. Not to be mistaken with Papa Gassy. Morgan Yu from um, the God, what was that game called? Space game. Ray, that one. That ability gets me every single time. Morgan Robin. 
How do magic builds work against her? Do they do any do they do well? Because I know she just jumps around if you use range. Dodges most casts. I feel like magic builds would actually um struggle a bit too. Purple rocks. Yeah, maybe gravity is her weakness. Radon had the best chance. Let me try playing it really. Let's try safe. Why hasn't she bled yet? What? That was weird. I know you're gonna use it. Can she tell after half health when you're low? Probably. She just started zooming. And now she's not zooming anymore. Storm flies too, but recent patch kind of nerfed it. Skip it this time. Now let's see if I can actually live. Oh, I can't go in it at all? Okay, that's good to know. Oh god. I was on the same attack? I thought it was. Oh god, she still has that ability. I'll wait for it to fade a bit. I thought I could get some hits on her. I guess you could throw magic at her there. Hee <laughs> hee. She's just standing there. I wonder if it'd be worth it to like craft something to just throw like poison pots at her or something. Like melee? Melee, no. Magic. Magic, yes. It's had a craving for, for spam certain weapon arts. True. You guys remember Craig Blade? I miss Craig Blade. Craig Blade was cool. I not believe I miss her. Make the second form really easy. I love Craig Blade. It just looks cool. I think it was one of the first weapon arts I got, and I was like, this is cool. I used it for a while. I think she's, if I have my debuff on the whole time, I could probably see that twice before I get her to her second phase. I'm thinking, let's see if I'll order food. If I order food, then that makes it easier because it's like, okay, hey, stream until food. Let's see. Food. 
do want to go get junk food out. I had sour keys for the first time the other day. I don't eat much candy. Sour keys are bomb. So good. Yeah! Love sour, key, sour candy when you were a kid. I feel like it's not the same now, sour candy. Gummy sugar co covered in regular sugar? Exactly. It gets to the point when you eat uh, sour candies and your mouth just disintegrates. Oh god, black cherry warheads? Danger. Is that like a Canadian Sour Patch Kids? Wait, do you guys not have sour keys? Like the ones that look like keys. They're just like, they're pretty much Sour Patch Kids, but shaped in a key. Really? What? They're shaped like keys, yeah. Or they're called Sour Suckers in some places, I know that. Are they called Sour Suckers in America? More well. I gotta Google this. This is important. Sour key. Oh. Candy. Can't type. My hands are like my fingers hurt. Like these things. I'm not crazy. Open image. These. Wow, that link's really long. Thumbs up on Canadian Shopify. <laughs> And they usually come in like a tub. And they come in all different colors. This one. No, nobody knows what these are. What? Is everybody just memeing? You're a sour sucker. I love how much my earring jiggles. Like, wash, wah, wah. We're loud, though. My keyboard is very loud. I just use, like, a generic keyboard. Eventually, I want to make my own. There's, like, Kirby keycaps. I want it on my escape key. It's so cute. I need it. My stomach is growling so loud. Those look delicious. <laughs> I guess sour keys are just a Canadian thing? Like, really? What? Who would have thunk? Hate this ability. And of course, she does in her second phase. This next to poutine is weird Canadian food. Hey now. Poutine's good. Poutine's good, but it's not like life changing. People say like, oh, you just have to go to like Quebec because Quebec has all the good poutine. It's like really just comes down to it's fries, gravy, and cheese. Gravy. You like all that, you'll probably like it. It's very, like, homey food. Very co comfy food. Comfy, cozy food. Ow. 
be the right poutine. Like some of it could be really bad. Like I, I think McDonald's has poutine here. It's obviously not. Midlife changing, midlife crisis, midlife change. I can't even get to her second face now. This is what happened. Wendy's has poutine too, oh god. I think it's food. I think once I start to get hungry, my hands don't move as fast. My brain slows. I hit her, I hit her, okay. No! Pizza rolls. I don't think we actually have pizza rolls here. We have pizza pockets, which are the same as like hot pockets. Haven't had poutine in a while, trying not to die. <laughs> That'll be what put you over the edge. One last poutine. have poutine? Uh, I don't think so. I don't think they have fries. Well, Morris is not good. We talked about this last time. Morris is no good. Donuts? Okay. Cheap. Not that great. But if you want a lot, very quickly. gonna do it. Like, see, look, I have to, like, force you to do it. Do it! Now she's gonna get in the worst possible spot. Okay, this is good. Good place. Please do it. She's not gonna do it. She's gonna wait till I hit her once or twice and then do it. Vietnamese food is so good. Like you think, oh, I'm just gonna go for it. I'm just gonna hit her. One of us will win first. I win! See right here, you can just throw some magic at her. Break. Oh, that kick is cool. Uh oh. That's really cool. Oh. Poop on her! <laughs> yeah, I should grab so I should make some poop in a pot. She's so cool! I will give it to her. She has the coolest design in the game. Like bosses. Honestly, I think she's one of the coolest FromSoft boss designs. That move got you more. I didn't know what to expect there, but uh not disappointed. Where's my poop? Poop jar. Poop. What does it say? Craftable item prepared using crack pot, a cocktail of effluent sealed inside as a mixture of ferments, toxins are produced alongside the putrid stents that seeps out once ripe. Ripe. Beware though, who's those who carry the pot will slowly accumulate poison in their own potty potties pot. <laughs> oh my god. Push someone in a privy. Expect to get dung on your hands. <laughs> so is it better to do the poison pot? Or the poop pot, because the poop pot has a drawback. But is it super OP because it's a poop pot? I don't know. She is naked. Rock pot. Throw some holy water at her.
Loot pot. What else can we throw at her? Swarm pot? Let's try swarm pot. Sure. Let's try a little bit of everything. Let's just throw some shit at her. Enjoy. Wait, my poop pot. Poop pot? Not poop pot. Is she worthy of gold tinged poop? Yes. And she is sneaky. Indeed. Wrong way. Why? Wow, ten poops. There was a noble dung in uh in Neo. Is there noble dung in this? I don't think there is. Just gold dung. Poop tier list. Soulsborn and Soulsborn like games. Because I think a lot of Japanese games have, like, for some reason, poop that you can throw and or eat. Why? I don't know. I miss. Blood tinged? Wait, is there blood tinged in this game? I think there is actually. <laughs> I think I'm dead. I think I'm dead. I think I'm dead. I think I'm dead. Dead, dead, dead. I'm fine! See how'd that work? All Kojima games have somebody peeing themselves? Why? I'd rather have them peeing themselves or pooping themselves, though. Hey, all the way. I mean, what? The wisest poop. I'm too distracted. No, oh, no, 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 no. You run from me! My hands are so clammy. She likes to do her kick a lot. Melania. <laughs> That's actually... Her just stabbing me, that flower. I am Macarena, Macaron. I love macarons. Macarons are so good. Very expensive, but very good. I know a girl who makes them just for fun, and they are so good. I think I posted a picture of them a long time ago, but she made green tea and black sesame ones, and they were Macaroons! Macaroons are the coconut ones. The nut. What nut? Macadamia nuts? Those ones? <laughs> no, 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 no. No, 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 no. I'm dead. <laughs> oh. <laughs> No, uh, macaroons are the coconut ones. Macarons are the little sandwich looking ones. The really cute, expensive. Macadamia nuts are so cute. Chocolate coated macadamia nuts are really good. Now I'm just hungry. My hero macadamia. <laughs> I like that.
Wait, is the bit icon you have? Um. No, no macaron. Mochi. The one you have is uh, Daikuku. Not very mochi. I always forget that you can't run if you don't unlock your camera. At least backward. Squins. <laughs> yeah, I love how small bit badges are. That's why I like the um, pixel bit badges, because then at least it's meant to be pixelated. I see Kirby with leaf hat. That works too, honestly. Or is that one? No, that one's soccer emoji. Kirby pretty much is a mochi. A human, a living at, uh, humanized mochi. Oh, anybody want a random uh, anime recommendation that randomly me and Krimchi watched? It's called Summertime Rendering. If you like Higurashi or like really weird-ass, uh, I don't even know how to explain it, small village horror anime. It's very good so far. It's very creepy. It went from zero to a hundred real fast, and there's only five episodes. Like, okay, okay. Can't really say much without spoiling. But... Good time. I think it's only on Disney uh, Plus Japan. So short anime. It's gonna be 25 episodes though. It's called Summertime Render or Summertime Rendering. So unfortunately you have to watch it illegally, but uh, it's just weird that it's not on anything else that I know of. Yeah, it's a Japanese coastal town, and, uh, yeah, it's really creepy. <laughs> it's cool, though. The premise is, like, there's these creatures that can copy your appearance by taking, like, a rendering or almost, like, a picture of you. And then they can become you. And then their goal is obviously to kill the original and replace them. It's really creepy. Definitely my kind of anime. Gives me very Higurashi vibes, except if Higurashi wasn't like a bunch of little kid. Like I like the art way better than Higurashi. Late. More time rendering? Yes. It's very cool. And the main character, like, cause obviously the whole thing of it being like a time loop thing, every time he dies, he goes back to the beginning, quotation mark, beginning, but he's not stupid. He doesn't, per like, he doesn't go and die 18 times to see if he's actually coming back. I feel like a lot of main characters are like, oh, I can return after I die. So they go and die a few times just to make sure. Like, what? He dies twice and he's like, okay. This isn't, this isn't good. Higurashi's also very old. <laughs> and they're children. I do like Higurashi, but... I would like Kigrashi more if it was art like this.
run. Sometimes she does it again, sometimes she doesn't. Remind me the poop! Remind me to throw the poop. Severance and Tokyo Vice. I feel like anime ages. If it's drawn bad, it looks bad forever. Same if it's good. Just look at the original Ghost in the Shell. Yeah, like old. I love old styled animation. Like I love Trigun and like Yu Hakusho animation. Even like old old like Dragon Ball Z and stuff. It still looks really good. You gone her HP to zero yet? Yes, quite a few times. I know nothing of TV shows. I am TV show noob. Ooh, haha. Uh -huh. Uh oh. I feel like I was so far away that time. So it's one of those fights, yeah. Exactly. I think food will be ready soon. So I'll go I'll go a few more times till five o'clock. Whew. I shake my hands out. Shake my hands. Got this, got this. At least I can get through a second phase, haha. <laughs> That's something, right? I would have lived if I had some more health. It's, I think the saddest part about the fight is you can get her to half health and you're like, okay, this feels good. And then she hits you like three times and she's back to 75%. Like, oh, okay. Oh, I have a large sippy. Large sippy before fight. Book sippy. Baby sippy. I'm so happy for my birthday. I pretty much asked like my parents and all my family. I just won bookstore gift cards. So I bought a whole bunch of manga. I almost have all the jujitsu up to date. And then I bought a bunch of Dora Hey Dora. Again there, almost have them. Change my hair, change my hair back. Boop. Every time. Every time. I think for that one I have to go behind her? I don't know. My brain like... Veggie. Oh. 
almost bankrupt the studio. It's crazy if you look at the animation nowadays. Like, Demon Slayer's animation was insane. It was like movie quality in the episodes. <laughs> like, the newest season. I don't know. Everybody watched it, but... Budget over 9,000. Million. Kinda trying to get rid of Poke and then run away. Same with games, when they're like, yeah, we almost went bankrupt. It's usually the best, uh, best games. Because obviously it's, we almost went bankrupt, but we didn't. Uh, yeah, it's your pool table. Ow. Demon Slayer, yeah, the animation. Demon Slayer itself isn't actually that long of a story. Like, people are thinking it's going to be a super long shonen, and I'm kind of glad. Maybe I'm just too old. I'm kind of over the whole 18,000 episode shonens. I'm okay with, like, 80, 80 episode shonens or less. Near. What's red line? TV show? I missed! I missed again! Because I think after this, there's only three more Demon Slayer arcs? An anime. An Amazon Prime. Yeah, I watched Naruto. That's long enough for me. Props to all the One Piece fans. Like, I know that shonens in general tend to be longer because, I mean, they usually have a million characters, so they have to give them all some screen time. <laughs> Is One Piece ever gonna be done? I don't know. Yeah, half Naruto is filler. I watched it growing up. If you watch it ongoing, it's like, whatever. But, yeah, if you're gonna watch it now, skip the filler. <laughs> Not the size of the shonen. Even then, if you go and watch Naruto now, Naruto's still good. I feel like there's certain anime that if you watch them ongoing, it's easier, especially like with shonens. This season has so many good anime. Like that summertime rendering is really good so far. Uh, then Kaguya season three, obviously. And same with Spy Family. Spy Family is so good. Remember when I first learned what filler is? A lot of people know what f filler is, but they don't know why. Filler is made when they catch up to the manga and they don't want to BS like their content, but they kind of do. They make fake episodes. Which I think doesn't happen as much anymore because seasons, obviously they can have gaps in between. Like I think a good example is Hero Academia. Your academia is a shonen, but the manga's still going. Oh. And, uh, but because it's season based and not just like weekly releases, then they have time to catch up. Or the manga has time to get ahead. My family's so good. It is so good. I think it's the perfect combination of like comedy and action and just good time. It's just good time. If you haven't watched Spy Family, watch Spy Family. Very good. Or just started when I was in primary school, ended when I was working full time. 
I think Naruto, I went, I watched it for like 18 years, I believe. Before it ended. How long did it air? We don't talk about Burrito though. Ooh, that's a go to the right. Okay. I figured it out. Accidental learning. Mama. POV, I'm the water. Fillers are twofold. You either take an anime and the filler is stuff in between. Yeah, the thing with the fillers, sometimes it's okay, but sometimes it's characters that you don't give a fuck about. When it's ongoing, it's easier to watch the filler. But if you're like binging, it's hard. I just can't believe that they won't let Naruto die. Just let him rest, please. I get it, Burrito's not horrible, but like it's already, what, 300 episodes? How? Taken back by the degree of popularity that a Spy Family has. Expect it to be popular, but not this much. I know the manga's super popular. Bleach had some pretty bad fillers, too. If I don't pay attention to her health, like it's like right when she hits the 75% mark. Oof. What's the other one? Oh yeah, Shield Hero season two. I haven't started that yet. Play scenes from some old 80s and 90s anime. So many of the old anime are good. I love that Bleach is just now getting its last season. It's so weird. It's like, what? Like, Bleach, you can wait. I don't think my hands can go anymore. My hands need a breaky. I also need some dinner. I think next stream, I am confident that we could beat her. It'll probably be the whole stream, but it will happen. Because I don't need to level up anymore. I'm 120. So I think I'm okay. The only other thing I can think is if there's something in here that's like... Could help me a little bit more. Boost all damage negation. I guess I could probably tank one with that. <laughs> Just explode. Negates damage. I don't want to try that. Did I just say stone curb? Wait until the season had been written. Because how long has Bleach been done for? As long as it's done, right? Let's try. I'm so excited for Chainsaw Man, but that has a release date. That comes out uh, this year, right? October. And uh, Hell's Paradise. Hell's Paradise is gonna be really good. It's October? Yeah. I think it's on Halloween. I think they did it on purpose. I don't know. I think that did stagger her more. Yeah, Chainsaw Man's really, really good. I feel like some people are gonna be like, what? And then same with uh, Hell's Paradise. Hell's Paradise is pretty short. It's only 13 volume. He's very good.
gonna be an acquired taste. That's true. Same with Hell's Paradise. It's gonna be a little, a little strange. Third manga. Atsuki Fujimoto. Also, that brings me back to uh, summertime rendering. It's uh, airing right now, and yeah. If you like horror, watch it. Hell's Paradise for Jujutsu manga cover? Really? <laughs> Hell's Paradise has really pretty covers. I actually don't find the Jujutsu covers to be that great. Jujutsu needs a new season. The new season is going to be massive. I think it's got like 800 fights in it, honestly. And Kez, thank you for the coffee. I was like, what is that little noise? A little mini noise. I will buy a donut. Go with the coffee. I'm caught up in Jujutsu. I think the manga's two arcs ahead of the anime. She missed me. If she missed me, I would have lived. Really like Dorhe Doro's uh, manga covers. I didn't know there were so many books. I binged. Binged that manga. Definitely one of my favorites. I'd say it's like, if not my favorite manga. I would say it is. I think so. Then she has her new manga now, which was equally as weird, but in space. Crocodile head? Yeah. You like weird, but kind of like wholesome? Oh. <laughs> it's basically Dora Dora in space, like actually. If you're looking for something fun, the fun story and really good group of psycho cast, uh, read Dorhe Doro. Maybe it diverges. Dorhe Doro in space. <laughs> the anime is good. I think the anime is a good intro. It made me want to read the manga and know what happens. Hoping for the seat. I don't know how they're gonna animate the rest of it. <laughs> It'll be interesting. There are some parts that I don't know how they are gonna animate it, and uh, yeah. yeah. It's gonna be like Chainsaw Man in that way. Actually, I think Door Hater is a little bit more, a little weirder than Chainsaw Man. Do the second season of Dora Dora. It's animated by Mappa, though. Okay, I should probably get dinner. I gave it a few more tries. Time flies when you're getting beat up by mommy all day. That was your biggest fear? Like, them animate it? Like, yeah, when I was reading parts of Dora Hedera, I'm like, how? How would they ever make this an anime? <laughs> There's so many weird parts. People would be like, um. Yeah, the Vampire Garden. I think it's a, is it a movie or a series? That one looks good. And it's on Netflix, so you can just binge it. It's kind of nice. There's so many good ongoing ones. Tomorrow. Oh. Yeah, I'll have to check it out this weekend. Probably go get some food. And I'm definitely going to go get some donuts or something. I feel like I feel craving donuts. 
I think these were some good attempts. I got to a second phase, which probably doesn't mean much, but I did. I did it. And uh, yeah, so hopefully next stream I can beat her and then we can also start on uh, Godfrey. Godfrey? Manga for Dor Hey Dora has its own companion soundtrack, if you like Industria. I know, I love the soundtrack. The soundtrack for Dor Hey Dora is so strange, but so good. Progress. I feel like I got here in a fortunate time. Okay, Clutch. I knew you were coming, so I'm like, hey, it's time to go. <laughs> I'm just kidding. But I hope you all have a good night and a happy rest of your Sunday and a good week. I will see you next week. Bye bye. I'll leave you with this ambient music. Bye bye.